Welcome to another episode of the Review Baron. Today I'm standing on my chicken coop and I'm going to be giving a quick review of the Happy Coop Chicken Door, automatic door. All right, this is the Happy Coop Door from the happychickencoop.com. So a couple of things I want to note, I'm going to back it out here a little bit so you could see is that I've got it installed on my nice form, Formex chicken coop here. The thing is, it's not a perfect fit to the door. I've got a small gap on that side where I fine with it, just adds a little uh, airflow into the chicken coop there. But installing it, I was able to still get a couple screws in. I don't think that's been an issue at all, but let me bring back into it. So, question, does it go up and down how it's supposed to? Answer is majority of the time, yes, it does. The times where I've had issues is the battery goes dead, so it doesn't have a plug. It's got uh, four AA batteries in it that runs it pretty well. The other issue that I've had is depending on how you've programmed it. So I'm going to show you how what's going on here so here it tells you the time that's one of the first things i'm going to check it's right now it's saying it's 3 17 and it is still the right correct time which i had an issue once where it wasn't which for me wasn't a big time because i had it closing and opening according to the light which is a nice option so winter time would close sooner daytime would close later but then you could scroll through its different options here Mm -hmm. Ah, there we go. Current time, set the time. Uh, open time, you could say what time you want it to open. You just go through the settings or on how bright it is in the morning. Uh, what time you want it to go down. And I'm actually going to adjust this a little bit because it's winter time right now. And I had it 8.15, but it's dark by 5 o'clock. I just don't want any predators. I'm going to change that to 715. I had it by going down by the lightness outside, but we've had some uh, cloudy days where it was closing before the chickens went in. And also I use a lamp inside that turns on as it gets dark. And so I think they were just chilling out here thinking they had more time than the door closed on them. And so I've got a light in the morning, timer on the evening. Current light level is that. Protection level, that's if it runs into something as it's closing, it won't squish your chickens. It's a good thing. And then save and exit. All right, so I'm good there. Uh, one other thing that mentioned with this, if it does close before they go in and you do have it set by light, this thing can be a pain to like take apart because there isn't a button just saying open this. Uh, you'd have to go through the settings, change the time and stuff like that. I wisened up. I had it set to light and it closed too early. I brought a flashlight. So I even stood outside my coop, shined the light on sensors here. And after maybe five seconds, door opened up. Chickens ran inside, turned my flashlight off, door closed again. So instead of going through all the work of changing batteries or changing your settings, you could Go ahead do that overall it's been a good experience i've had it uh over a year now and it seems to been working good so if you have any questions go ahead shoot them to me once again this is the review baron and I'll just... <laughs> thank you so much please like subscribe ask any questions in the comments section i'd be glad to answer from my experience of using this chicken door chicken coop anything in regards to chickens one of my hobbies anyway we'll talk to you later thank you for watching bye